Hi guys, how you doing today? So I just want to start off my wish list Wednesday by showing you one of the first things on my wish list, and it is these chocolate stirring spoons, and it says a melt away chocolate treat. And I love putting chocolate in my coffee, so instead of me pouring it in there, now I can put just a spoon in there, and it will work out really good. And this was on my wish list. I saw somebody else, don't ask me who, because I watch a lot of channels. If I do remember where I see some things, I will let you know. But this particular thing, I saw a few people grabbing it, so I'm not really sure where I saw the person. Um, you know what I'm trying to say, right? So anyway, okay. <laughs> let me get on to the next thing. Okay. So, and then I got these candy cane spoons. And again, I don't know who it is that I saw hauling these, but I just wanted to get these. And so I finally found them. And then I, these were on my wish list that I saw somebody haul. And I don't remember who it was because I don't, I don't just like watch haul videos. I watch like DIY videos, decorating the house videos, um, you know, like putting on makeup videos, you name it. So I... God only knows where I, I saw half of the stuff. But anyway, so pom-poms. I got the white, the green, and as you can see in the back, the red. And what this is, is it's like a um, a trim. You know, a trim of pom-poms. And it's um, three yards, so that's actually pretty long, you know. So anyway, guys, that was on my wish list. Grab them. And I have a DIY that I plan on doing. And so I got... A white duct tape and red duct tape and hopefully I'll get a chance to show you those DIYs I saw a couple of different channels um, doing this one particular DIY so um, when I do it I'll link their channels um, you know when I get to doing that one and guys this was not on my wish list but I saw it and I had not picked this up before, and I thought this was so cute. So I grabbed him, and I think that he could be made into like a shelf setter, is what they're calling these things, I guess. But right now, he's um, he's got a string so you can hang him like a ribbon. But see what I mean? But I think I might want to have him like maybe sit on the shelf. I don't know. I'll figure it out. And guys, these were not on my wish list, but obviously when I saw them, who could resist Santa Claus and hit one of his reindeer? It's not Rudolph, but it's one of the reindeer, right? And that's in the way of Santa Claus's face. So there they are. How cute are they? Okay, guys, so total wish list, okay? This one in particular, I really, really wanted. I did get the one that says Deck the Halls, but that wasn't so much on my wish list as this one. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas, and they're written on both sides. And just so you know, here is the Deck the Halls, okay? So Deck the Halls looks like that, in case you haven't seen them being hauled. Um, so there's the Deck the Halls, and there's I'm Dreaming of a White Christmas. And they're good size um, cups too. They're really good size cups. They're not overly big, but they're definitely not small. And there's your size right there, four and a half inches high, okay? And guys, these were not on my wish list, but I was looking for some socks that looked like they had kind of like a candy look to them. And so I saw these, and this will fit the bill. I'll, I'll show you why, okay? Hold on a minute. And these are the Snuggadoo socks I want to show you before I take them apart. Okay, I'm going to try to do this quick, and I hope I don't mess it up. Okay, so this is like an empty ribbon spool. So basically what I'm going to do, and I do know where I saw this because Olivia from Olivia's Romantic Home is my go-to girl for crafting. So I saw her do this so many times over the past couple of years. So what she does is she takes one of these socks that kind of resembles whatever she wants it to be. A lot of times it's candy, all right? And then I'm just gonna cut it off right there. 
Okay guys, and this is the ribbon that I have on hand. So I'm just going to use this and I'm going to tie a bow at the bottom. Okay guys, here it is. Half it's getting it's coming along, but I think that um I'll probably end up cutting more of the bottom off of it before I finish it up and I'll show you what I do. Okay guys, I took a couple of these crafter square, I mean a, a crafter square mini bow. And then I'm either going to take this straw or let me see. I think I'll do this straw and I'll show you. Okay guys. So it's not perfect because I didn't start out this video planning on doing this DIY. I was just going to tell you about it. Um, but so you can still see that the sock piece needs to be cut. But so that's why I put that like little. You see how it's like that in the back. But this Thing should be really glued in there so basically you just go in there beforehand and you glue it onto that then you tie it but like I said I didn't start this off planning on doing this um, DIY but then you get it it's like a lollipop and you just like stick it right in your tree okay and it's like that on the back and it's like that on the front so and usually you just put one bow on it but maybe even like a little bit of lace at the bottom and maybe a bowl that has two sides that are like the same color. Do you know what I mean? But how cute is that lollipop for your tree, right? Out of a sock. So guys, I just took it apart so I could tell you that before you do this, okay, you glue that either a harder stick or the straw right to there, okay? You can hot glue it, or you don't even have to glue it to there. You can like glue it like to this part of it so it stays better. Do you know what I mean? All right, guys, so you get the idea of that. But anyway, that's why I bought these socks, and so it turned into a little DIY, but it was cute, right? And guys, another thing that was not on my wish list, but look at the fluffy stuff, snowballs, cotton candy. How cute are those, right? I'll open it up so you can see it, okay? Okay, guys, so it does not come in the shape of snowballs, okay? Because I tried to take the balls out, and it's just all cotton candy stuck together, but I guess you could probably just make it into balls, right? But I just want to show you that my bag, anyway, it's not. It's not balls. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Good thing I opened it. Okay, now I got all kinds of woolly stuff all over here. I shook it out, but hopefully it'll be okay. And then I had to have this snowman cup, and this is a big one. Is that bigger than the other cups? Let me see. No, it's not any bigger height-wise, but it's bigger, like, opening-wise, you know, because look at... See? That cup has like a little piece of like something at the bottom of it. So see, that's pretty big. How cute is that little snowman, right? I could picture that though, getting... Just be careful with that, I guess, right? And he was on my wish list last year. So I forgot about him and then I saw him again. I'm like, ooh, I gotta get him. He's so adorable. And then I figured any yarn will do because I got that, um, you know, the pom-pom maker. And so I figured, let me get some cute yarn. And this chenille yarn is really pretty. So I got this to see if I can make a really pretty light blue pom-pom. Um, and guys, this elf was kind of just like hanging around all by himself. Like, in other words, there was not another elf with him. But he was in with that Santa Claus and that little reindeer that I showed you. And this, he does, he talks. So let me, um, let me shut that TV down for a minute. All right, so, one minute. Oh, okay, so he said he's going to put on his green elf shoes, I think. 
Let me hear that again. Oh, don't step on my green elf shoes. Okay, you're going to get the blues if you step on my green elf shoes. And then the, the pot. <laughs> I didn't hear that pot. But anyway, isn't that cute, guys? I love it. And then, guys, I got these. These were on my wish list. Um, these are the only things that work for me. I don't like tweezing my eyebrows, you know. So, anyway, this, this works for me. And I love these. And so I grabbed them. And then I grabbed these, which I was looking for some blocks at Dollar Tree, you know, in the toy section. Because sometimes you can find some really good things for DIYs in the toy section. And that's exactly what I need for this. I mean, that I need these. I need these for like a little DIY I'm doing is what I'm trying to tell you. So, um, yeah. And so I grabbed these. I grabbed like five packs of them. And this was also on my um, wish list. Today my wish list was a little bit different, you know, it was more like for DIY things. And I got lucky that I found these bags because sometimes you can't find these. So I got these. And guys, check this out. They are really coming up with a lot of Wonder Woman stuff lately. And now they have a stocking. Have you guys seen this? I have not seen this. I always see the stockings there every year. They had a Spider-Man one. When I was there earlier, they had, um, well, I can't remember all of them, but this is the very first time I have seen Wonder Woman. So I grabbed a few. And guys, last but not least, I found these. And if these aren't the most adorable things I think I've ever seen Dollar Tree have for plushies, okay? I could not believe my eyes when I saw these. I hadn't seen these being hauled before. I don't know if they were. But I do know that there was a lot of girls. There wasn't a lot of boys there. I wanted to get like three because I have... I mean, I wanted to get four boys because I have four grandchildren. Then I wanted to get three of the girls. But it ended up that I couldn't. So I just got this set right here. And then, of course... I got another set for a giveaway, okay? And that'll be more toward, like, the end of November, that giveaway, okay? So, how cute are these, right? Oh, my God. I had to have them. Let me see how tall they are. Just so you'll know, because sometimes, you know, you wonder. Okay. So, that sitting is six inches, Okay. So lengthwise, obviously more. So anyway, guys, I'm going to end it here. But I just thought these were so adorable. I had to have them. And, you know, they're new to me. They might be new to you, too. I don't know. But they're beautiful. How can you not, like, immediately put them on your wish list when you see them, right? So anyway, guys, I hope you're having a great day, all of you. It's rainy. It's stormy. It's windy. There's trees down in the area over here. I went to two Dollar Trees first, and both of them were closed because there was no electricity. I finally found one that was open with electricity. So I hope you guys are okay out there. I'm in New England, and we had a really bad storm last night. So anyway, guys, stay safe, and thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I hope you're all having a great day. Bye now.